Now, what are you planning to do with Mum this Mother's Day? Why not take her out to visit a garden near you? You'll get some great ideas on the website, gardenstovisit.co.nz. Jackie, this is your website. Welcome to the show. Hi, Mel. Thank you for having me. So firstly, tell me a little bit about your website. What do we find there? Um, well, I set it up in 202, so it's 10 years old, and it's grown. We've got 60-plus private gardens on there. We have public gardens and I have a few international gardens and we have some events. Really? So people mm. can go along to your website and browse through gardens that they might yep. like to visit? Yes, there's a search engine on the right hand side of the home page. So they search by region, just put a region in and um, the gardens that are in that region will come up. That is a great thing to do with Mother's mm. Day mm. because gardens are so fast. It's great to look around really nice gardens as opposed to my own barren wasteland of nothing except <laughs> like a neglected pear tree. Um, so what do, you've chosen some gardens for us to look at here. Obviously you've got lots on. I can't call them your favourites because that would be favouritism. Yes. But you've chosen four very different gardens for I us have. to talk about. So talk me sure. through this first one. Okay, well we have Stuart's Garden which right. is in Wanaka. That one, um, wow, and that, beautiful. Yes, that's uh, the lovely Pat that owns that garden is a real plants person. Um, and that garden is built on a lot, a very wet um, piece of land. Hence so it's quite, feature. yes, it's very boggy. <laughs> and they have a, apparently they have trout, um, tame trout. Wow. So, yes, yes, and it's an acre, and I think Pat charges $6. Okay, so that's, visit. So that's in Wanaka. That's in Wanaka. And the next garden that we have is Alan Trott's garden. Now this is Ooh, amazing. It's quite different, isn't it? Look at it. Uh, that's a chapel in the background. So Alan does weddings. And that knot garden, that's called a knot garden right. because the bucks are unders and overs. Um, probably one of the better knot gardens in, or in New Zealand. And Alan would tell you the world. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'd say he'd be right. It's fascinating. It is. It's an amazing garden. And he has a lot of very large borders. Um, he has water, so ponds. How much, how much upkeep would that take? Oh, it, sort of it every waking hour. He has people in to help him with the lawns and the hedges. But you, you can get married there. What a beautiful Yes, you setting. can. Yes, beautiful it's setting. beautiful. He had that chapel bought on. And where is that one again? Uh, Ashburton. Okay, so where's the third garden? The third garden is Sutton's Garden in Hamilton. Oh, that's and lovely. And the lovely Anne, I spoke to her this morning. She's actually in Spain. Oh, nice. <laughs> and I just I said to her, well, you're going to be on TV. so um, <laughs> Make sure you tape it. Yes, yes. So if you want to buy a Mother's Day um, visit to the Sutton's Garden, you probably can't. But um, this is a very formal garden. And Anne is a... She's fanatically meticulous. So it's... it's I would call it a perfect garden. It looks immaculate. And it's finally... Very, it's very... Um, very symmetrical. What's your final garden? Uh, Alafoir, which mm -hmm. is in the Coatesville, West Auckland area. Oh, wow. Uh, that's What's a that deer. Um, when I told Marguerite I was going to put that photo on, I said, I'm putting the photo of your horse. She said, darling, it's a deer. Uh, even <laughs> I can see that's a deer. Oh, OK. <laughs> and that's up in Coatesville. Right, yes. yes. So there's all these that's incredible... Large incredible gardens to look at. Oh, there are. There and are. obviously people yep. put all their time and effort and they, they some do. are free, some cost them some money? Uh, no, most of them charge. Yeah. Yes, some, um, the money goes to charity. But okay. uh, no, it's a business for them. Um, a lot of them have B&Bs. Right. A lot of them have cafes, animals, uh, weddings, as I say. It certainly looks beautiful. So, and something a little bit different to do with Mum this Mother's Day. So best thing to do is go yes. to your website, which is yes. gardenstovisit.co.nz. Correct. All the details are there. Jackie, thank you so much. It's My pleasure. pleasure. Got okay. a lot of inspiration there as well.